Who Lives Who Dice is an improvised D&D show that may contain violence and adult themes. Content warnings can be found in the description. Hello, uh, there's a reason I'm blindfolded <laughs> and I'm about to find out why. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Happy Halloween! Happy Halloween! Hello and welcome to Who Lives Who Dice. Uh, we're all Matt Bateman. <laughs> We're all dungeon masters, all game masters, all mm. busted Bateman dad, <laughs> babes. I, what the I was too busy focused on this to think about that. <laughs> busted Bateman babes. Busted Bateman babes. Uh, enjoined by the busted Bateman babes, please introduce yourselves. Oh, I'm... Hi, I'm Matt Bateman, also known as David Cox, playing Alexi Karstav. Uh, I'm S Matt Bateman, also known as <laughs> Sasha Bergwin, playing my. I, I don't know who I am anymore. This is a, I'm having a complete crisis so of my identity. <laughs> I'm Matt Bateman, played by Naomi Clark, who's playing for. Love it. Hi, I'm Matt Bateman. Welcome to Who Lives Who Dice, and I'm Reese Lawton. I'm also playing Toot or Tutorial. Also, it's so warm in here. It's so warm. Oh, so oh, warm in here. So, so warm. Oh, so warm. Yeah, you know what? Yeah, I need to take my hat yeah, off as hang well. On. Just, yeah. it's just, Don't worry, everyone. Just I'll just... All right. I can, Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I can fan myself with my ear flaps. Uh, <laughs> there she was, fanning herself with the flaps. All right. Oh, God, I'm so tense. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have the cap. Uh, <laughs> Naomi, best beard by, by a long, oh, that, by a long shot. It that is, is a is thing glorious. of glory. What is that made of? Do I want to know? So it was a cheap beard, but um, I cut it, styled it, and spray painted it because the color wasn't quite right. Very Fair. good. It's good. It's good work. I made this from scratch. Yeah, I did too. <laughs> this I've is, been this growing is, this I for years. years. Hang on, hang on. Hang on. You, did you knit that? Yes. Crochet okay, no, sorry. <laughs> I crocheted yeah, no, no, no. this I, beard. I didn't know. I didn't know. Yeah, that's, that's fucking it's sick. Amazing. It's good. Thank you. It's yeah. amazing. If anyone would like one, I'll I'll link the pattern in the description because yes, like yes, yeah, great. It was, I maybe just that. To make I'll just start one. making shit tons of beards. Here's an idea. That's a gift for our Patreons. Hey, who wants a shit beard? And if beard? you're not on the Patreon and you're considering doing it, has it ear links. links down below. It's <laughs> actually really good. Like and now I, you'll I've get seen, the pattern. I, I'm not gonna lie. I've seen some really bad crocheted beards. Mm. <laughs> The, what I, what what look, world are you in that you're looking at crochet? Sometimes I need crocheted beards. Anyway, and that's actually a really good one. So I can guarantee the the quality of that. Are you proud of us? Dad? I'm so proud. <laughs> I'm so proud. Dungeon Daddy, can you tell us we're good? Okay, and with that, <laughs> with that lovely. Don't segue, make thing. Daddy mad. <laughs> <laughs> Bit late for that. All right, <laughs> settle in. <laughs> Comb the beards. Flop them up a little bit and let's settle in for this very special Halloween episode of Who Lives, Who Dies. Drum roll, please. Your own voice bounces against your skull, Alexei. The words of your alter ego paint visions in your mind, shattering your reality and everything you thought to be true. The cast off's true place in relation to the gods, to society, the fact that a shred of Torog survives through an ancient familial sacrifice. And that same sacrifice slowly corrupts the dynasty over the generations, corrupting the original mission as your family become cruel masters. <laughs> over death, turning the back on the Raven Queen's noble deep needs and using it for their own selfish goals. The offer also sits on your soul, a sacrifice to restore death, a different cruel and permanent death, but a solution nonetheless. A deep bang wakes you up as your friends are already up and about in the servants' courses, deep in the Coldhaven dynasty. Doing deep banging. Sorry. <laughs> Do it. The makeshift blindfold and earmuffs dull your senses as the rest of the party make their preparations to escape the castle and attempt to find the catacombs. And with it, answers to death and the redemption or ruin of your family. So, 
with a time limit in place and pressure coming in from all sides, what happens next? First things first, how much of other Alexia can I feel bouncing around my own head? Can I feel any, like, leftovers from the spell he cast on me? Sure, make uh, make a general wisdom check for me, please. Ooh, I'm bad at that. 18. 18. You, you feel... You feel uh, it's it's hard to differentiate between what is you and what is him at this point. That the familial, the familiar ways of how you used to sort of engage and think, you, it's sort of relapsing almost a little bit. You know, clearly you don't think this way anymore, but there's still that sort of like that niggling feeling a little bit. Maybe he's right. It's not a pressure. It's not a direction, but there's definitely a a temptation and influence in the middle of that. Uh, I am going to start repeating, in my, replaying in my head every single embarrassing conversation I've ever had. Like, Mayway talking to Alexi about sex, this asking is, him if he'd ever had sex with anyone. This is inflicting psychic damage. This is what you're doing, right? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I want to make it as unpleasant an experience for him as possible if he's in my head. Uh, <laughs> basically, anything that I know that Alexi would find uncomfortable, I am just dwelling on. So what we're doing, we're casting vicious mockery <laughs> at yeah. this point. All right. I'm like, if you're going to be in my head, I'm going to make it not a pleasant place to be. Uh, yeah, he fails. Uh, roll a d4 of psychic damage. <laughs> nice. One. No. Yeah. It's it's not much, but it's just enough that it, it shakes off a little bit and you swear you muttering about the fucking melee. <laughs> cool. What are the rest of you doing? So, while we've got... Alexi. You've all completed long rest at this point. Yeah. Now, yeah. yeah. Uh, so while well, we've got Alexi kind of sat in the corner, uh, while we've had our long rest and you've had your long rest, we will wake up four and just... <clears throat> Hello, four. Good morning. Oh, morning, four. We have a plan. We oh. have a great plan. Oh, Good. we should point out that Alexi is currently blindfolded and also has something in in his ears. Mm -hmm. Good, good, good. This is, on some level, kind of an improvement. For What's happening? Oh. We have drafted up a grand plan. Yes. It is called Plan WTF. Yes. Uh-huh, and, and WTF stands for... My, my thoughts exactly. Wreck, wreck, thieve, and fire. Wreck, thieve, and fire. <laughs> oh, hell yeah! Our plan is that we okay. will destroy <laughs> parts of this castle, then we will steal parts of this castle, and then we will set some of this castle on fire. Yes. Ideal. the plan. I thoroughly enjoy... Bathhouse. <laughs> I thoroughly I'm enjoy... I'm so glad this is this man's ancestral home. Let's fuck it bodies. up. <laughs> I thoroughly enjoy this idea. Okay. I would also like to point out I am thoroughly enjoying a, an idea. Wow. I'm very proud of myself, but also we should destroy things. We should. Very well. <laughs> Is this the first original idea Toots ever had? I think it's like pretty first much. Kind of plan. Yeah, first first plan. Take an inspiration. You. Yeah. Yay! We need that. We need. <laughs> oh, we will. Don't lose it. <laughs> <laughs> very well. He says to the bald cap underneath that hat. <laughs> All right. Very well. Let us begin. And we will kind of, I will pick up Alexi <laughs> and kind of like do a ratchet around and spin around to disorient and start walking through the door towards the vault. Yeah. Now, oh, are sex. we going to do, should we do vault first or library first? I think library first. Oh, okay. Yeah. <clears throat> library first. Library first. Cool. Oh, wait, isn't the... Oh, wait, no, it's the archive that's the... Yeah, yeah, no, library first as... So just yeah. just to pull out of character for a second, have you shared these maps with the others as well? Or I've shared you... the maps with Reese. Okay, cool. Yeah. <laughs> I know nothing. <laughs> Good. <laughs> Reese and I just wanted to qualify that our plan worked. Yeah. And by plan... <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> So we're, sorry, so we're going archives or vaults we're first? We're doing library. Library. Library first. Okay, library first. cool. Great. Love, love that. Do love it. No, 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 it's good. It's, it's great. It is, it is exactly what we need. Okay. Yes. Can I sort of have my phantom steed 
just sort of Jay chilling in the background. Is that going to be okay, or is, do I need that spell slot? Oh, I'd keep your spell slot. Keep cool. The spell okay. Slot. Fuck spell that. Slots Never mind. Don't worry about it. At this point. <laughs> no, so uh, at this point, let's just chill we're, we're and make chill. our way to this the library. This is a chill, chill voyage to the library. Um, as I'm being carried, I'm going to be thinking all sorts of different numbers and like anything if other Alexi is trying to count by like vibrations, how many steps are being taken okay. and in what direction. Oh, you're doing a, you're yeah. doing a great job. Okay. Right. And it, full interference. <laughs> like Every now and then, two will we'll just kind of like spin walk on the spot, yeah. we'll spin around. Wiggle you. We'll, yeah, we'll, we'll generally wiggle you. Yeah. And cool. we'll occasionally make the noise of, we are walking down a hallway. <laughs> Let's go up these stairs. My Alexi, clunk, don't clunk, jiggle, clunk, jiggle. Clunk, clunk. <laughs> oh, sorry, there we go. All right. I'm so sorry. <laughs> so, um, <clears throat> I'm sorry. That was good. I'm going to say it again. Was very yeah, good. Go. Yeah. Yeah. My Alexi, don't jiggle, jiggle. He's bald. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, uh, got You're so old. It's fine. I'm, did you get it? I did. Whoa! I know. That I'm very, very proud of myself, and I'm very old. <laughs> 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 Cool. Oh, so, I just don't know the song. Oh, honey. Uh, oh. yeah, right. Like, get 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 on the internet. Okay. Okay. Right now, just just Actually because. Don't. Yeah, no. <laughs> it's morning. We do have a castle full of people on the lookout. Mm -hmm. How are we going about this? It's so not. It's not. It's not a. You know. It's a short wander, but it's not. Yeah. For the initial part of the plan. Yes. I think we're assuming. Just. Go straight there. Go straight there. It's not about stealth. No. It's not. You want to set off as many physical alarms as possible? Oh, yeah. oh, oh, let's, oh, no, know, let's use, let the day yes. is young. Yes, <laughs> okay. Cool, cool, cool. The day is the young. Day is lo young. And there there's are so, so many, many alarms. alarms. <laughs> there's so many alarms. <laughs> and there's only a few of us. Yeah, how many could we set off? At once. Okay. <laughs> how many indeed? Marching orders, please, lords and ladies. I think. You at the front. Oh yeah, we're carrying, carrying Alexi, <laughs> Alexi like a whittle baby. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> For any shenanigans, you're at half movement. Just, just, Ruby. just so we're on the same page with yep. that. Cool, cool. I'm glad I made this ahead of time. <sighs> right. Like a whittle baby. Uh, four and Myla. I'm at the back. Cool. I'll go in the middle then. I feel like Myla, maybe you should be in the front. If I'm basically like next, so like I'll be like next to two, pretty much. Yeah. So like. Yeah. Yeah. So like he's obviously holding Alexi. Yeah. So it's like a human meat shield. Like should I just should I just get the fire minis ready as well? Oh, if I were you. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> right get... now, Matt. Let's not preempt, but also <laughs> let's, let's preempt. preempt. Well, just while I'm here. <laughs> you know, okay. As you know, with Plan WTF, the F is a key, uh, key part. <laughs> It also implies that we've made like 300 other plans and we've gotten down from A, B, C, D to A, A, B, B, C, D, <laughs> yeah. no. This is what, you were, you're just rainbow wheeling all night doing this, oh, yeah. right? I was, good, I good, was good. trying to make it plan CBA, but I couldn't quite make the words <laughs> work, which I also thought would have been really, because okay. I was going to go for like something arson, but then couldn't yeah. quite, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Chaos, burglary, arson. Ah. Oh, shit, I got chaos, not burglary. You slowly emerge Sorry. from the servant stairs. Um, Milo, with your passive perception, actually you pick this up as well too. Uh, you you do hear the odd footsteps moving back and forth. No no hurry, no rush, but you do hear a pretty consistent pace moving back and forth across the corridor. You can just emerge, or we can do checks and go straight through. That's probably a guard, right? Yes, most likely. Do we want to try and distract the guard to achieve our first location? I believe first location is is. Is paramount. Is paramount. Yes, I agree. Okay. Other, we we do not wish to alert preemptively. Mm, I concur. I can concur. I. Sorry. Can no, I please. just take a moment and say this is all going to go very wrong. Oh. But I look forward to pulling <laughs> you all out at the last minute. What a beautiful time that'll be. But just don't, don't worry. We have the mouse gambit for yes, when everything I kind goes of wrong. <laughs> When um, it all goes wrong, we will have contingencies. Yes. Good, 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 good. There's the mouse gambit, and then if all really goes to shit, there's the eagle has landed. <laughs> cool, great. Joke's on me for giving them level eight last episode. So here we go. All right. Cool. 
Uh, <coughs> either of you make it. David are just going to hang out for this episode. Just no, no, like no, 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 <laughs> no, 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 no. You are key <laughs> to key, key players. Sounds like you're an unwilling participant is what is what I'm picking up In here. In fairness, that's usually how it goes. All right. We were like, we cannot have the others be passengers. Yeah. This is key. Myla, this make a perception check for me, please. Oh, I'd love to. I'd love to, Matthew Prime. Um, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, oh, it's going nice. to be It's going to be high. Cold um, Bateman. Um... <laughs> Uh, da, 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 24? 24. 24, okay. Yes. My nose is Thank so you. itchy. I know. Oh. There's, 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 there's... breathable beard. <laughs> no. Available now on uh, patreon.com slash you lose your guys. Gonna... <laughs> cool, looking past, you do see two, uh, not red guard, but you do see two guards patrolling back and forth, coming and checking. Okay. Are any back. of them recurring characters that we've seen before? Uh... No, no, these are brand new Aww. with names I'm going to come up with on the fly in a second. Is, is that the entrance to the library there? Sure. Okay, lovely. Um, okay. Shall, shall I, or four, run a distract? I believe that would be best. What would you prefer? Do you want to go do cool. a distract? Yeah. Um, you go. Just, Unless just, I huck a Lexi at them, I do not believe I would be a sufficient distraction. Mm, mm-hmm. I see, I see. Four? Fine. Yeah, I'm going to turn into a Lexi, but in fancy underwear. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Which Alexi? Specifically, evil Alexi or other Alexi? If it's e, okay. <laughs> Which Alexi is it? It's evil Alexi. Cool. If it's evil Alexi, it is in a PVC leather um, corset, fishnets, big boots, and a whip. And I'm just going to come running and say, "Get back here!" <laughs> okay, wait. So which? So you come? So Evil Lexi comes running in, in a leather getup. <laughs> Fuck's sakes! This which, is this is pure like Doctor Frankenstein kind of like yeah. yeah. Okay, cool. Sprinting immediately, come come up straight through. They're gonna make insight checks. Natural one and natural six, absolutely not. And I say, get after my slave, you fools! <laughs> yes, he's yes, got yes, sir. to lick. <laughs> He's got goats to lick. <laughs> oh, he's not kidding around. Ah, they both run off. All right, fine. I crack the whip. <laughs> Love it. Oh, I hate this already. To the Let's... library. <laughs> to the library. <laughs> to the library. I don't know what you were expecting. I... Mm. So we come to the library. At one point, probably of entirely ill opportune moment, Alexi will just go, oh, if um, anyone wants to know where he is, let me know and I can probably tell you, but I can only do it once and it'll only be for 10 minutes. Don't worry. Right. Thank you kindly. What? That will be, that what? will be used. Sorry. Uh, and once we are in the library, I will take off, I will kind of like pull out one of the ear things and uh, I'll kind of like pull the blindfold up a little bit and say, yeah. thank you kindly for the offer. That will not be necessary. Very much keeping his eyes still closed. Like, right. But Alexi, yes. what part of this castle would hurt you the most if it were destroyed? Um, well, this is my home. Thank you kindly. <laughs> <laughs> and ear uh, back in, blindfold uh, down. Uh, and I'm gonna. This is uniquely uh, terrible. Burn, baby, burn. Disco inferno. Burn, Did someone say baby, gun? Burn. <laughs> <laughs> Who's so, gunning? This is you so stressful. Be, you will be shortly. <laughs> <laughs> so. Okay, yes, so you come into the library. Uh, <laughs> I'm just gonna play the deaf man all Just, that. just. Yeah. <laughs> It's gonna be great. I don't know. I don't know what you're talking about. Um, walking through, and if if Alexi has briefed you at all, um, it's a very large, grand space, very clean, very tidy. Um, books seem to flutter about, fisting themselves back back into shelves. But most of it seems just just there for show, there for display. More and more shows of power and wealth than a practical. There are reading nooks set up, but the chairs appear not to be moved in some time. There's a lack of scratches on the floor. It's it just seems like. It's not comfortable. It's not. It's not a place for reading. It's a place for look at how great and well read we are. It's someone who buys books, puts them on a shelf, and never reads them. This guy right here. Uh, so, at this point, you don't see anyone else in the room. Excellent. So the first thing is um, at that this we need point to... you don't see anyone in the room. That's that's all good. Cool. Just checking. Just it checking. Doesn't, it doesn't matter. We've heard GM anyway. speak before. It's fine. Yeah. yeah it's okay. We're, um, we're familiar with you. Doesn't look trapped. So I think we we firstly need to enact um, plan uh, part T. Part T. Part yes. T. Um, and then immediately, Plan F. <laughs> yes. So we, we, we require Plan T. Plan T. Um, or plant. Plant. 
and then plump. While they're doing this, plump I'm already like plump. just fucking stealing shit. <laughs> yeah, just, so we'll, yeah. Come, we'll come. We'll come back. We'll come back to that. We're gonna take like just the nearest book off the shelf. Okay. Uh, put roll, roll a d100 for me. Cool. Um, yeah, same here. And um, <clears throat> and then we're gonna set it all on fire. Yep. Yeah, we are. I'm on fire. <laughs> Okay. That is a that is a fifty-five. Oh. Okay. With a fifty-five. Two. Uh, rapiers and radishes: the archival history of the sixteen hundreds and the gallivanting of Drivius, oh, Alexi. Cool. Mm. The ravishing of radishes. Well, you mean Chapter Drivius three. Cast out. Yes. Forty-one. Oh, for you for stealing shit. No, we're just all picking up books. Okay. <laughs> this is GM dance, monkey dance. GM, time. GM dance, monkey dance. Um, the timeline, the timeline of Trivius cast of, uh, the great hazard of the dynasty. And where, where Burning are you now? And two. And two, uh, you pick up a picture book <laughs> of how the cast of's first ever feeding, and it's a step-by-step book of how to eat. <laughs> this is horrible. It's awful, isn't it? This is horrible. Um, Children giving thumbs up on yeah. corpse is just in the background. <laughs> <laughs> I have never been more sure that we should do this. <laughs> And you keep it. <laughs> and I keep it. Great. Plants. 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 Let's go. Uh, as ABCs always be consuming. So there you go. <laughs> oh, oh, everything about that. Every sphincter in my body. Um, and there's a lot of them. Uh, right. Calm that. down, Matt Bateman. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So here's here's a fun thing. Searing smite, right? Sure. He says. Double checking it means I set my thing on fire and I hit thing and that thing on fire. Sure. Or, just open to opinion on this, wall of fire, there's a lot of fire. It's a lot of fire. I have a cantrip. You have a cantrip? I have sacred flame. Oh shit. Sacred flame is radiant. radiant. That won't set fire. fire. Yeah, Yeah, no. No, I don't need radiance. Flame yeah, no, yeah. no, let's, let's... Searing smite, like anything that conjures fire, fire will start a fire. Yeah. How big the fire is will affect what happens next. Mm. 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 I feel like I need a puffer just whenever you say it. I think of... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Everyone drink, yeah. Okay, let's... Cheers, babe. This seems the most... This seems the most flammable of plan. Mm-hmm. So I'm going to go with searing smite. And I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna searing smite something, and wherever I picked up the children's book, I'm gonna smash it. That nice big, yeah, that big. Like, Your job bookcase. is to just go. I'm gonna wreck it. I'm gonna wreck it. Great. And as you do that, we're just gonna quickly cut to four running down the hallway. You're stealing shit. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you lose them pretty quickly. Um, you do find yourself though. You find you you sort of push through a large double door and carrying through and you find yourself in a long hallway with large statues made of gemstones on either side. Roll a d12 for me, please. Cool. Uh, would you say these statues were portable? Seven. Uh, with a seven. Would you say these statues are trapped? Uh, you have to do a proper look for that. <laughs> um, each one's about 15 feet tall, um, standing, Christ. and as you sort of inspect closer, made of pure gemstone. You see a large one made of ruby in a sort of human shape with a long rapier. You see a green one with a large axe and broad shoulders. Um, one draws your eye in particular though, and you, you find it's a feminine shape with a nice light blue Classic. Uh, classic. One of them draws my eye. Draw- to in- <laughs> Come on, Draw- Matt, Alright, let me finish yeah. the description. <laughs> Uh, you find there's no scepter, there's, there's sort of like a cloth cut into it, but you also notice, unlike the others, this one has sort of a, a fine platinum crown adjourned at the top, around the ears. You said you want us to steal shit, I'm just giving you the option. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I understand this is a trap, but um, this is also a story. I, I'm going to grab that crown. Okay. Uh, it's 15 feet tall, how are you getting up there? I'm just going to climb it. Okay, make an, athletic, <laughs> make an athletics check for me, please. I love the idea that you're like, currently in like, full Dom Alexi, Eve Alexi, <laughs> yeah, scrambling up to get... What is, what is the, 11. actually, 11? Mm-hmm. Okay. Um, yeah, what, is, what does that look like? What, what would Alexi look like in full leather get up? He has no idea. <laughs> but David, David knows. David knows. He does have a long leather coat. 
and his pants are leather. <laughs> okay. With an 11, you start, manage to sort of grab up, you sort of grab, manage to hook, like, the arms, it's it's not inclimbable, you're about to get, about to get halfway through up, then you, you suddenly feel this sort of, like, electric pulse through your body. Uh, make a constitution saving throw, please. Hell yeah. So that is a 21. With a 21, you feel for a second your limbs beginning to lock up, but you manage to force through and shake it off, um, and you're still able to hold on. You want to keep going up, or do you want to drop it? Was it trying to, like... Turn me into a gem person or paralyze me? Uh, you feel like beginning to paralyze potentially something else beyond that, but you shook okay. it off beyond that point. You, you you had actually you had enough sense of experience there. Potentially petrification was coming into okay, play. Okay, cool. cool, cool, cool. I'm gonna take the whip. Okay. Whip that bad boy. Off okay, make an attack roll. Love it. Okay. 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 What's my whip attack bonus? Uh, just your. It's a dex. It's a finesse weapon. Cool. So, um, do I have proficiency with a whip? Just, just, yes, just do it. Great, 20. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no proficiency, I might not do it. Uh, yeah, you grab it, it hooks around, you, and you flip it, catch it, not a problem. At that point, three red guards walk in, you hear the door open behind you as three guard walk in. I put the hat on. You put the crown on? Hell yeah. Okay, I'm gonna paste you the stats now. There you go. <laughs> uh, however, at that exact moment, there's suddenly a <laughs> as the sound of an explosion comes from the library down the hall. Please describe what that looks like for me, Reese. It's a big old hammer made of fire smashing through some very flammable books. <laughs> it's not like a hot knife through butter, but it's definitely like a hot knife through books. Uh, David, uh, Alexi, Matt, yeah. whatever your name is, you take three points of psychic damage as you feel the pain of your box being burnt. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I did I did prepare you for this. But it doesn't matter. <laughs> it's the best thing that's ever happened. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. I did say we gotta <clears throat> Yeah, we're gonna have to make some, it's okay. some sacrifices. Alright. You hear the explosion, what do you do? You put on the crown, you immediately feel this power take through your body. <laughs> Great. Um are they between me and everyone else? Uh, they're blocking. So it's a, it's a long hallway you've walked down. Mm -hmm. There's some portraits back if you keep walking away from the door, or there's a long hallway. There's no other way you see out at, the, at this point. Great. They are between you and everyone else, yes. Cool. Um, <laughs> do they do a... Huh? When the sound yeah, yeah, they're definitely Great. distracted by the sound of an explosion. Great. I turn into a regular guard and I run past them. Okay. <laughs> really relying on this changeling shit, my guys. <laughs> yep, that's what... 11, a 2... Yep. They sort of like they're distracted, but then they see the shape of you running past. They immediately know what's going on. They begin to chase you as you run towards the library. Cool. Right. We are now setting shit on fire. Great. Fantastic. Love that. My God. All right. Um, do you guys need more time, or shall I just bring toys to you? No, no. 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 <laughs> cool. It's all good. Yeah, it's all good. This is the first of the alarms. This mm -hmm. is alarm one. Yeah. <laughs> cool. Immediately, fire starts to erupt. However, Alexi, you feel in the back of your heads. Uh, your slight foray into wizard's prowess, you suddenly feel like a magical enchantment take place and suddenly water starts to drop from the roof as the fire is extinguished Excellent. as create water. And the books are, for now, at least ruined, but the fire is distinguished and you hear footsteps coming through as a regular-looking guard comes sprinting into the front door. We'll set this guy. In my head, I picture a dragon chest board and mo move the first piece. And leave it open. O okay, sure. What happens next? I believe we should reach our second target. I agree. Wonderful. Hoist Alexi. <laughs> <laughs> All right, there are also three red guards sprinting right behind. Cool, cool. Cool. What happens next, team? We head towards the vault. We do. The vault? The, the vault. vault. Oh, the vault. Okay. Pushing past the guards. Yep. Okay. Mm. To like, yeah, yeah we, we might, we might. All right. We'll have to, you know. Everyone, please roll initiative then. Lovely. Well, it's a classic. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's, <laughs> Did you uh, look at it? Right. That's a real vintage Myler initiative. So, that's some classic Myler, is it? Yeah. Have you done a? Have you done a good? I, it's not bad. Oh, not okay, bad. But I am good. carrying Alexi. Uh, Let's find. That's actually pretty good. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Don't get involved. <laughs> What, what? Um, we can also remove his blindfold yeah. at the moment. 
because Actually, it's fairly yeah, obvious we where we are. Yeah, yeah. So that's fine. Yeah, I, uh, imagine I can smell burning books. Yeah, also that. But like, also we we. I said about the smells. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that is going to be. We'll just put it back on for the next we didn't have dinner. stage. The next that's stage. Okay. That's cool. There is a further stage. You know that's that that absolutely is? fine. So didn't make us get dinner. <laughs> Cool, okay, 25 yeah. to 20. <laughs> 20 to 15. 18. Yo. 17. Uh, cool. Seven. Four. Brilliant. Uh, oh, my life. Cool, okay, on the first, on the first guard, seeing the four of you now in here, uh, is gonna go for an original quarry and is gonna go for a stab against you. Uh, Who is you? Uh, against four uh, in that one. Matt so, Bateman. <laughs> yes, Matt Bateman, Matt Bateman. obviously. <laughs> obviously Matt Bateman. Bateman. Going to make two long sword attacks, drawing this sword against you. Uh, does a 13 hit? Meets it. Meets it? 13 hits? Okay, so you're going to take two hits on the back of that then. Uh, which means you're going to take... Uh, you take 11 points of slashing damage as... Boom, boom, Two quick cuts coming on the back of that. Cool beans. Cool, great. Uh, Alexi, you're up. You are still blindfolded and deafened. Uh, all right. And two to still holding you. Uh, uh, yeah. I don't think there's anything I can do then, is there? Can you hold your turn? You can hold a reaction. Um, you can remove your blindfold as a bonus action as well if you want. Oh, we took we've we've oh, we is my, we'd take them off. My blindfold's already off. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. I can you see can that see. there's a fight. Yeah, 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 yeah. Fantastic. Cool. Right. Yeah, I'm. Hopping off, and I'm go. I'm I'm seeing a red gauntlet currently attacking a random guard. Uh, you are seeing yes, sanguine gauntlet. And you see two more closing in on. Yeah, this I guard can as put well. two and two together. Uh, I will I make four. Yay! Yay! I'm going to draw He's my sure. rapier and I'm going to <laughs> charge into the one that's just stabbed four. Okay, cool. Go for it. Uh, go and make uh, your attack roll, yep. please. Uh, bonus action. I'm going to ignite it with radium five first. Go for it. Oh no, I just put it in my beard. That is one point of damage to me. <laughs> yeah, it's hard, right? <laughs> okay, right. So, one was a natural two. That's going to miss. Yes. Uh, the other one was a 16 on the die. Takes it up to 23. 23 absolutely hits. Go for it. Lovely. Um, oh, yeah, that's that's pretty sweet. Um, separate at all or all together? Uh, just all together, please. Yeah. Okay. Blah. 14 points of damage. Great, cool, great start. And I am going to hold basically there. I want to sort of take a position as much of that door as I can. Okay, so you come and sort of block the door from the side there. Bottom you right, yeah. <laughs> straight through. Yep. One, two, straight through the gut on the back of that. Cool. Two, you're up. Very well. We'll turn, have hammer. Have hammer will smash. Good. And go and <laughs> smash. Uh, I'll smash the one that just stabbed four. For a 24. 24 absolutely hits. Yep, good, good. And that's a double-handed. So, here we go. Oh, yeah. That's 10. That's 10. I yeah. keep forgetting. I'm like, zero? <laughs> no, it's a 10. So, 13. In 13 total. points of damage? Great. Just wham. Cool. And Following up behind Alexi immediately, and you then like taking the stabs, it recoils it just to be hit square in the chest with a big blunt hammer as it <laughs> bends in a little bit and starts <laughs> coming back in. What happens next? Uh, we'll. <laughs> oh no, I haven't had time to build it yet, so another time. Uh, <laughs> That's okay. <laughs> another time. Another time, time for another once day. We've had a bit of downtime after this. Um, yeah, and so I will. Uh... Yeah. Oh, Searing Smite wasn't still on it. Okay, ignore that. Um, That's all right. We'll know for so, next time. Yeah, so I will, whilst holding my uh, oh. hammer, I will cast Magic Weapon on it. Okay, is that a bonus action or a full action? That's a bonus action. Bonus action, not a problem. And yes, so I will cast Magic Weapon. And so that's now a, a better weapon. A better weapon? It's a better weapon. Okay. It is a plus, plus one. one. Great. Cool. It's magical as well. Yeah. It's all magic. Okay. 
hit. So what happens is, is he takes a, from the tummy drawer, he takes what looks like um, a little oil can, mm -hmm. and he just. And it's kind of like it covers, and it's a little bit glittery, and then just kind of puts a big glob on the end, and it kind of surrounds it, and it just looks a little bit harder. Yeah. Okay. Great. Next up, both the guards are now going to go. Both are going to run in on you after seeing you make this massive hit on the main one. So the first one to come in. Um, oh, actually, you're coming in there. So only one can really get in at this point. The other one's going to have a go at you, Alexi. So we'll do we'll do two first two hits. Ah, uh, that's going to be a miss. Dirty twenty. Uh, yeah, uh, dirty 20 for three points of slashing damage uh, and against Alexi 19 hits. Uh, cool. Uh, and then you're gonna also take let's roll that properly uh, six points of slashing damage. Cool. Um, straight up on that. Cool. Right. At some point, someone's gonna have to give me a single instruction <laughs> as to how I proceed here. Well, <laughs> welcome to my life. <laughs> Four. You're up. Great. Um. So there's two lads. The I have a question. Yes. Do we know about what the deal is with the red guards and whether the divine magic is going to be good C or bad C for them? Because I don't remember. Well, I've just radiant magic them. Also, Matt, I was shit at maths. I should have done two points of damage more than I said. Um, I've already divine magic them, and it seemed to be fine. Cool. Um, in which case, a deck save throw for two who are close together. Uh, so all three are sort of close together, so these these two here on the back. Whichever one's the most hurt? Uh, sure, so that'd be, yeah. Cool, great. Deck saves for both. Mm -hmm. uh, that's going to be a 19. That will save. Uh, and a 9. That will not save. Okay. Um, 1d8 radiant, radiant damage. On radiant damage, yes, good. Uh, oh, you roll that, not me. Yeah, yep. 5. 5, cool. Uh, we'll say the main one's still on the attack at this point. Starting to look a little bit hurt. Cool. Mm. Uh, movement bonus action. And then I'm going to spend a single spell point. Sorry, what was that spell you just cast there? Sacred Flame. Sacred Flame. Okay, cool. Um, I'm going to use a Quickened. Okay. So to turn something into a bonus action, hence why I'm doing two Yeah, go for it. Set. Just you are a melee range. Any range spells with disadvantage. That's cool. Uh, it doesn't have to be ranged. Cool. Um, just just in case you were planning shenanigans. No, I think... It, oh, fuck. Sorry, guys. <laughs> no, um, no, no, you're yeah, good. Fine. Don't, don't, don't apologize. Don't ever apologize. How dare you? How dare you? Oh, you know what I will do? I will do a Wither and Bloom. That's a great one. Great. And it's a saving throw. Cool. So it's con save, I believe. Con, what's the DC? 15, I believe, she says. Uh, they both pass. Okay. I don't think it actually matters because they still get some fuckery. Da 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 da. One, two d six halved. Necrotic damage. Math. <laughs> two necrotic damage. Cool. To both, but more importantly, um, I get a hit dice to heal myself. Nice. Cool. Just keeping an eye on it. It's good. Great. Uh, Myla, you're up. Um, I can't really do much while everyone is sort of behind. It's very clogged else. up at this point. It, it feels like Yala's trying to like stop them breaking through into the room. Um, um, can we start moving? Is that an option? You can start moving. Yeah. Okay. If you want to. Which case, you. if they've said a second location. Yeah, we did. You, did you point? The vault. Yeah, we said the vault. Okay, I'm gonna head towards the vault. Okay. Get... Okay. Cool. Uh, you will get attacks of opportunity. Mm -hmm. Okay. Great. Uh, we already done. So it's gonna be. 15, all bomb form. So we're going to say two attacks of opportunity on there for that. Nat natural one and a dirty 20. Uh, so you're going to take another seven points of slashing damage as you say, okay, hit cut on the side. Cool beans. Coming through. Cool. Nice. Uh, Myla. Cool, 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 cool. All right, so now I've got a little bit more, a little bit more space, spacey space. So I'm going to scoot on up into that little spot. Uh, which, which one, sorry? Just, just, this, just the free, the yeah, free space. Yeah, you got it, you got it, you got it. Um, lovely, lovely, lovely. Uh, um, and actually, four, you've got a little bit more. Are you still you or are you still the guard? I'm still the guard. Cool, understood. Um, and the the one just in front of me, uh, I'm going to um, hold out my hand and release a puff of noxious okay. gas. Okay. And cast poison spray. That cool. is a con save DC 16. 16. Uh, 
two fail, one pass. Cool. I, I can only do it on one, I think. So I was saying the one in front of me. Oh, sorry. I thought you said, okay, I'll, no, I'll, re- I'll re-roll then. Sorry. My mistake. Uh, let's fail. Cool. Sweet. All right. That is... Cool. Hang on a moment. It's looking pretty rough. Hang on a moment. That's that one. And that one. Is it... Cool. That's eight points of poison damage. Cool. What happens next? Oh, sick. Yeah. Um, in that case, Milo's just like... And he just kind of goes like... Ugh! And like, I want to have him like go completely rigid and then just fall out of frame. The old timber. Like, yeah, 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 yeah. Just fully timber. It's just like the, the poison's got him. He's gone. Nice, nice. You, you, you walk up and and it kind of squares up to you a little bit and stands up to its full height. Good, like two and a half feet taller than you. You cast spray and as it breathes in, the metal starts to shunt and shutter and and all of you get a spray of bloody mist across your face as nice. it pops out of existence. Top of initiative. As you do this, you sort of turn and you look and you see this blurry-eyed human in purple robes starting to like peek out and walk out of the library, like slightly damp, looking very perturbed. Oh no, you've upset the wizard. What's, what have you done? What have you done? What have you done? What have you done? And it starts to sort of change and transform there on the spot. Uh, cool. Uh, top of initiative. Uh, that guards death. Uh, you do not. Oh. Cool. Alexi, you're up. Yeah. Oh, okay. Um, one of those is dead. Yeah. Can you move? Uh, yeah. 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 This one. Gone burgers. Okay. Cool. Then I'm just gonna uh, keep going for the one that I was attacking. Uh, yeah. Cool. Yeah. Yeah. Let's um, let's do that. Uh, okay. Right. So we have a twenty-two and an eighteen. Both hit. Lovely. Uh, one, two, three, four. Okay, right, that is, in terms of damage, uh, 6, 12, 18, 20, 23, 27 points 27, jeez. Sweet fucking merciful seeds. Matt, you're doing great. Oh, thank you. <laughs> and I, I say, are, are you coming? Yeah. <laughs> as, as you crack the whip? I don't, know, <laughs> I don't know where we're going. I was... That's probably for the best. Yeah. Cool. Do you want to keep moving, or do you want to stay with four or two? Sorry. Um, Follow me. What I'm going to do. Follow me. I have not been given orders. I'm going to I sort literally of. Literally just. Said. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Am I? Yeah. That yeah. was me shouting at you. Yeah. It's literally an order. Yeah. Cool. Then I'm gonna uh, follow full. Okay. Uh, there's gonna be one attack of opportunity. <laughs> Absolutely not. Great. Uh, cool. And you push past. Full movement, do, 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 do. you manage to start sprinting ahead and running up towards the vault. Cool. Okay. Uh, two, you're up. Milo, we should go. Mm-hmm. Understood. And we'll shove in front and run. Okay, so you're just trying to push him out of the way? Yeah. Great. Uh, we're going to make an so, athletics check. Yeah. Uh, contested. That's Shut a natural attack. two. Don't even... Oh, well, in case you get a nat one. No. no. Cool. You push, flies back, lands prone on his back. Good to go. Full, full movement. Cool. Cool. Uh, he's going to use a movement to stand back up. And I start giving chase on the back of that. Uh, four. Anything you want to do? You want to keep running? Boop, boop, boop. I know where we're going. Cool. Let's go. <laughs> Myla, movement, or do you want to stand and fight? Okay. Uh, you both start to gap it. Uh, you all start to gap, gap it. Gonna, it. I'm going to drop out an initiative at this gap point, it. but they are in full chase at this stage. Fine. It's only a short run. Uh, to the vaults. Yep, we checked. Yeah, oh, I know, I know. <laughs> cool. You come running up, sprinting around quick as you can uh, before turning to the right and finding yourself at the front of a large, fine, blackened iron door. Yes. As now we're what? running, um, let me know if I can do this because I'm slightly faster than everyone else. Can I be recurringly casting Mind Sliver on the weaker one that I've been attacking? Yeah, absolutely, if I you just, want to. Uh, yeah, I just want to fuck them up. Cool, I just make two two attacks for me, please. Oh, no, no, you need to do a thing for me. Okay. Uh, oh. Wisdom save? Anything yeah, you Yeah, 13 intelligence. 13 intelligence. Uh, one fail, one pass. Cool. Uh, in retaliation, Oof. they're going to take a couple of shots. No, no. Two points of I'm rolling like damage. balls tonight, too. Okay, Hooray! fine. Hey! Happy Halloween. If you're, you're faster as well, so yep. if you're going to get there first of all, do you want to start trying to open this vault? That'd be great. That'd be... Yeah, if I know the thing, then I can... You you know the vault. After uh, one mind sliver, then I am going to dash. That'll take me up to 70 feet. So I'm just going to start trying to get that sorted. Cool. It is... You, you get up front, these large, large maybe up 40, 45 feet tall, yep. completely blocked. Do not budge. Okay. What do you want to do? 
what do I know of this vault? Uh, you know this is where the cast hubs, it, it is the simple, easy access for anyone to get through, but it would take the combined keys or, in this case, touch of all the cast hub siblings. You don't know what the current status is with half of them being dead or missing yeah. at this point. Uh, you can attempt to try and use your touch if you want to see if anything happens on the back of that. Um, I do, but first things first, Alexi's going to turn to four and go, yeah. Leandra! Great. I turn into Leandra. Same outfit. I'm, yeah, I'm going to put my hand on. <laughs> okay, cool. You come running around uh, at this point. Sorry, Jan. To, to both stop, start unlocking the door. How the two guards are still both behind you. So we're going to stay in this initiative role at this yep. point. Um, we will... Uh, turn, turn about face. Wah, bah. Okay, yeah, cool. So we're going from the top of initiative then. Alexa, you put your hand on it? Yep. Okay, cool. It shows that there's, there's an intense heat for a moment, but then it cools and you just know in your gut it feels right. It yep. feels like, yep, cool. And just and you hear somewhere in the corner one of the locks starting to turn and click into place. Cool. Cool. Uh, you do... It's not your turn yet. We'll come around to you and see what happens. Cool. Uh, two. You have... Yep. Turn um, around, go for it. Whoever's closest. Wow. Cool, make Except your attack roll for me, please. Except my, <laughs> not my, uh, the other one. He said Mine whoever's closest. Ooh, 11. And 11, 11's going to miss. Sorry, buddy. Inspiration. Oh, yeah, I've got mm. inspiration. Do you want to use it for this? this? Yes. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's better. And I also forgot that I had a plus one on that. You do, well. yeah. So that is an 18. 18 hits. Cool. And so that is another one of these. And that is for... Uh, uh, Lexi, make a wisdom saving throw for me, please. So that is uh, 12 points of damage. Two. Great, cool. Okay. Including your cool. plus one. That's including magic. the plus one. You've betrayed me. Welcome to my life, buddy. Cool, you immediately <laughs> crack straight across the face. Uh, it's going to, in retaliation, uh, running up, it's going to ignite the sword on fire as it comes back to try and make a strike against you. Um, um. Uh, cool, that's going to be a 21. Oof. That will hit. Uh, and that's going to be an 18. Oof. 18 meets. So it 18, 18 hits as well then, cool. Alright, uh, so we're now going up to you and you. Uh, that's going to be 12 points uh, of uh, slashing damage. Cool. Plus... Uh, a further 6 points of radiant damage on top of that. Cool. Uh, and for the second hit... Oh my god. Uh, it's going to be 14 plus uh, 9. So it's an additional 23 Jesus. points of damage on top of that. As <laughs> as you feel yourself being carved up. Uh, cool. The next Ow. one's also going to come running in. Uh, on you, Myla. Hello. Same thing. It's going to ignite the sword. Going to make two attack rolls against you. I can't keep you awake for very long. Yes, uh, <laughs> a, a 14. Hits. Natural 20. Fucking hell. Okay, uh, apologies in advance. This is going to hurt like a bitch. Let's just roll he all says of this. Like he's actually sorry. sorry, I've got the no. most hit points. Oh, wait, 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 wait. This is so stressful, guys. Oh. 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 It's really too hot for, for this hat, man. <laughs> <laughs> okay, one, six, 15, 17, 21, 29, 35, 36, 39. <laughs> 45 points. You got nothing to, uh, uh, <laughs> that a bit? Like what? Do you have, you have any, you don't have any resistances or anything, do you? No. Fucking cool. cold. Yeah, it's not cold. I've damage. got cold and, yeah. yeah that's what it, yeah. have you got? What's happening? Uh, cold and 49, 50, 15, 21. 22 points of radiant damage and then As the well. rest is, no, 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 that's, that's, no, that's okay, cool, yeah, 22 yeah, points fine. of that was radiant. That's Cause um, you feel that slash come cool. across, but like it cuts and deep. Make Ow. a wisdom saving throw, please. Ooh, exciting. Um, is it a charm? No. No, it's just a regular one. This is I was just, just double checking because yeah. I've, got, I've, got, I've got some, you know, some stealth action on that front. 14. Cool. Uh, that's a failure. I need you to roll a thunder wave, please, at... F Oof. What's your max health? My max health? Yep. 82. Yeah, this is more than half. Yep, yep. Shit. Thunder wave, max damage, please. Christ. Are we all getting thunder waved? It'll be facing one direction, wouldn't it? I don't oh, know no, how this spell works. It is, it is. Just, no, it's, it's, oh, it's, shit. no, 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 it's, it's straight ahead. Thank God. Oh. It's in a 15 foot cube. Yeah, yeah, it is, it is. Yep, you're fine. Yeah. Nice. Cool. Um, so it will be them rather than. It will, it will be them, yes. Uh, right, hang on. Fourth level Thunder Wave. <laughs> this is going to be 
Right. How, I don't think I have enough d8s for this. One, two. Here are four. Thank you. <laughs> uh, three. Don't eight, take. Eight, don't take Matt's cursed four, dice. Five, six, seven. Uh, I need. I'll just roll one of these again. Okay. So that's five. Uh, Nine, eleven, eighteen, twenty-five, thirty-two. Roll one more. Eight. Forty. Forty. Cool. The one that hits you immediately <laughs> is evaporates into mist, blown away. The other one <laughs> gets knocked away. Stand, Get start to stand right, back up. <laughs> cool. Uh, looking really, really hurt, but not not quite dead yet. Cool. Uh, it's my turn, though, right? It's fourth turn. Oh, okay, cool. Thank yeah. You know, it's the second time Alexi has seen Myla atomize someone. <laughs> <laughs> and you know what? Oh. He's into it. But also, there's a. <laughs> Echoes Alarm around the two. hallway. Alarm number two. <laughs> cool. Four, you're up. Uh, I look at my and I'm like, uh, in, 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 in. Oh, the door's How not. How thick un- is the door? The door's not unlocked. Put your yet. fucking hand on the door. I put my hand Constitution on the door. Constitution saving throw. Well, um, that is an eight. Uh, immediately, your hand shakes. You feel a bolt of lightning hit you, and you're flown back twenty feet. Uh, you take. Nine nine points of lightning damage and a Be further a nine Leandra. and a further nine points of light. Eighteen points in total. That's okay. As you flow back, you're flooring as the wall and you land prone. Uh, cool. You've still got your movement and your bonus action. Great. So you know what that means. But you know you've been rejected. Yeah, that's fine. Um, great. Uh, I would like to use my new toy. Is what I would like to do. Absolutely. Great. So. Um, I assume that this is going to fuck me up, but who cares? Uh, which is... <laughs> I'm going to use H charges to cast a dimension door. Actually, uh, how thick is the door? Do you know? Uh, it's not 500 feet thick. It's not 20 feet thick, though, either, is it? No. No, that would be no. ridiculous. No, it's not right. 20 feet thick. Can you imagine how long it would take for that door to work? This door's not 20 feet thick. Yeah. Great. Um... Choices, choices, choices. Um, so I have I have Misty Step, which I can do, but that's only on self. Even yeah. if I twin it, it doesn't mean it goes on self. Correct. Whereas if I do Dimension Door, you can I, take can, small with you. I can take four of us. Oh, twin it. So I can twin it, yeah. That'll work. Yeah, so I'm going to cast, uh, use one charge of Dimension Door. Yep. Can I use my spell points on the Dimension Door in the, in the hat? Yeah, that's cool. Great. So... That's going to come back to bite me later, but that's yeah, fine. that's fine. No worries. <laughs> uh, I twin the dimension door. Okay. Um, so that I cast the dimension door with me and Alexi, and then I get, I basically put the other dimension door in front of these two. Okay. And I jump through it. Cool. And I put the other end of the dimension doors all in one in the vault. Cool. So, Milo, you sort of, like, start to come to and your, your eyes focus. You notice this lovely sort of, like, platinum crown, now adorning... A Four's head. Two things. Uh, one, you're drawn to it just a little bit, um, but then immediately you see it flash, and there's a big bright diamond in the middle of it, which shoots up two <laughs> dimension doors appear in front of you. Uh, as you look beyond that, you also start to see um, this raging, foaming at the mouth, purple beholder start to oh. come around. Yeah, that sounds about right. Disintegration ray, let's go. What happens next? I'm going to go in the dimension Yeah, we're all jumping <laughs> in that dimension. I'm going to go in the dimension door. Cool. Immediately you step through. Just in, in time for a... Nice. Ray hits the side as you get through on the other one. And you're inside. It is pitch black. Magi- magically, sir. There's one way to find out. <laughs> Cast sacred flame on the can nearest I object. See? You can. You see, you you see four cast a sacred flame, which doesn't appear for you. You feel the heat, you feel the power, yeah, but can there's I nothing. See? Else. No. Interesting. Can I see? Sure. Yay! <laughs> you think you can? You think you can see? You keep you keep thinking your eyes are closed, and you try to open them back up. Uh, okay, so what am I seeing? Uh, at, at this point, what you're seeing is you're seeing a much smaller, and I say smaller, about 15 foot. Uh, platinum door this time uh, with fine intricate handles and carvings of your family history the cast of crest but also a crudely drawn hand of Torog now defacing on the front of it you also look beyond you see stirring in 
the not candlelight but like a flicker of something down the hallway so if you turn to your left there's the door where you're facing but you look down there's sort of like a flicker of light or something down just beyond as if something's been disturbed by your present being in here. How far away would you say that is? 90 feet. It's, it's still quite a big space. Okay. Um, is it 90 feet and a, between us and an object, or is it 90 feet and has a clear route to us? Uh, there's a clear route to you cool. at this point, yeah. Cool. Um, I will sort of whisper that to everyone <laughs> at my most stealth, and you go, so what's our plan? Um, so now, uh, well, they can't get in for a little bit, hopefully. Are you really telling Alexi the plan? Is that wise? Hmm. So, we we have an idea. Mm -hmm. We are going to steal from the vault. Yes. Then we are going to destroy the vault. Yes. Thus, removing a vast majority of the power of the car staffs. Yes. Right. Um... But I'm afraid we will have to blindfold you again shortly. Sorry, one you second. Don't want We're going to destroy... Do you think he's getting this? The vault. <laughs> just just want to point out, it's still pitch black for you three at this yeah. point. Only Alexi can see. Um, Are you yelling while there's a creature down the hallway? Not quite yelling. She's mostly just been trying to... Yeah, see like you have been told there is a thing further down. Okay, cool. Um, well, you're a cast of, and you are an important, very important cast of. Now, right. presumably you could go talk to the thing and inform it that you're supposed to be here, and so are we. Talking's your strong point. Right. Okay. When Alexi walks away, <laughs> Toot will lean over to Four and say, in a moment, we would like you to cast Illusory Terrain. Great. Is that possible? Yes. And also, could you make it look like catacombs? <clears throat> yes. Thank you. Uh, I'm aware that they can't see shit, right? Correct. Yeah. Okay. Well, you, yeah, you're intelligent. You put two and two together. Well, I, I imagine it's as, as, as two talks to a wall yeah. while four <laughs> standing here. Like, kind of Milo's like, Lexi. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, then in that case, oh, yeah. all right. Uh, it's a straight shot. If you hear me screaming for help, you know which way to run. Do you want us to come with you? You can't see anything. No, but we can elephant tail. Right. Uh, <laughs> Is that a literal elephant? Uh, I will reach back and grab Milo's hand. Yeah, Milo will grab your hand. Milo will reach back and grab Toot's hand. Toot's hand and Toot will reach back and grab four. <laughs> Toot randomly just hand? grabs like a hand. book or something, yeah, yeah. thinking it's four. Yeah. <laughs> Toot grabs, grabs a hand. It's not fours. <laughs> four grabs someone else's hand. Yeah. You, uh, you yeah. conga line through the darkness, and as you start to approach this shape, starts to undulate slightly. Yeah, it's not easy, is it? It's, it's, uh... I don't know what you're talking about, man. Is that what I look like clean shaven? <laughs> oh, don't, don't. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Ah, I forgot where I was. This thing starts to undulate in front of you, and then it sort of starts to form and stand up, and it's this black... It starts like this liquid Icarus sort of thing until it forms into this solid obsidian shape. And this nine foot tall humanoid, no face, slight indents where the eyes would be, greets, and there's just this though. I love these guys. Does he do the post? The post? He does do yeah, the post. He does the post. Uh, not following, I'm really sorry, I missed the reference. Yeah, neither, neither uh, I'm neither on Terry Pratchett reference. Mm -hmm. uh, yep. Yeah. Just want to look at just, it. Just looks, just looks at you as if waiting for something. It, it takes commands. How do you even know? <laughs> Um, I'm dressed like a dominatrix. Of course, it takes <laughs> commands. <laughs> I thought you meant me. <laughs> <laughs> I I, um, I don't know about what yeah. if Matt takes commands. Lord Alexi Caster here to visit the vaults. Okay, make a persuasion check. Guidance, because I'm holding his hand. D four. Yes. D four. Only because you've appeared in here with some interesting looking people. Twelve. Yeah! <laughs> Quick, put your hand on your ha on your hat. Maybe it will help. Yeah. <laughs> or the the occasional. Yeah, they, these aren't my hats though, so I don't I don't want to rack them. You you see it? <laughs> see it falling off at the same time. <laughs> Exceptional. You see it cock its head for a moment, and 
it waves its hand slightly as three more sort of slither out. And I give it my best. I'm waiting. Look. It doesn't seem to pay you much attention with its fucking natural one <laughs> as the four of them start to walk out towards the platinum door, paying no attention to the rest of you. Each walks up and each stands. All four put a hand on the door and then it turns, the one that originally greeted you, taller than the rest, the body stays in one place but the head turns back to look at you and you hear in your mind, password. Uh, can I search my memory for anything that... Or search someone else's. What? Or search someone else's Search someone else's who's in your head. Start with your memory and then see how you do, how you go. (sighs) Fuck it, yeah, let's see how this mental connection thing works. Okay. I would like to mentally go toe-to-toe with Alexi. All right. And, yeah. Cool, we're gonna have a roll off. So cool. do you think I should shave my head or not? It looks good. It's a good, like, it's a good time. It would work. Can I give you work. guidance again? You can give guidance for this. Yes. Can I double that guidance? <laughs> now, luckily, because this is based off your character, wisdom's not the strong point. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, what am I rolling? We're rolling wisdom saves as you both try to probe each other's mind. Okay, can not good I to use the word probe. give myself a bit of a boost? This probably isn't how the spell particularly works, but, it, but yeah, go on. Um, using the detective's notebook to use detect thoughts as well to kind of just boost amp it up a bit. I will give you a, it's not a super powerful item, yeah. so I'll give you an extra two to the roll on top of that. Cool. Cool. It is a roll off and I'm going to do this on the tower. I'm going to stare at it and nod at yours. Okay. Uh, Reese can verify. Oh, what am I trying to beat? A natural 20. Yeah! Yes! Get wrecked. <laughs> to a 21. Matt, please try. I believe With in guidance. you. I believe okay. in you. Roll your seven nat 20s. Nat one! Oh! Oh! Can I make the Blast. chessboard show a checkmate? <laughs> <laughs> um, no, but you notice, you go back to in your mind and he makes a really silly move that opens it up to a four move checkmate or a two move checkmate at this point. Um, cool. and, and what's the name of that? Of that play? Of the of the play. Do I figure out the password? I don't, on passant. Uh, with a natural <laughs> 20, the password is whatever you want it to be. <laughs> Leandra's boobs. <laughs> Ew. 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 <laughs> Face the wall. Good God. <laughs> it's 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 something, something I want, but nobody wants to see the back of my head. <laughs> 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 oh. Oh. Not oh. your head. That is a monster. Oh, God, no. <laughs> Kill it with fire. <laughs> Put the effort um, in the front half. <laughs> <laughs> the title of my life. Ah, uh, right. Uh, what's his dad's name? Antonius. What? His dad's name is Antonius. Oh, God, it? don't ask me Hang that. On. I've, I've this written down. Godfrey. It's not Antonius. <laughs> oh, no, no, Tobias is the uncle. I. Godfrey why would you. Why it's would okay, you it's okay. I've got it written down. I've got it written down. Godfrey69420. Angelus. <laughs> yeah. It's not, it's not Angelus. Yeah, isn't it? Godfrey's the best. <laughs> yeah. Godfrey for God, life. Godfrey was here. Cassius. Cassius. Cassius there we go. Thank name, you. Thank yeah. you. You know what? As a bigger fuck you to Alexi, I'm making the password Cassius. <laughs> okay. You 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 focus for a moment, and you you find yourself butting heads with yourself. Yeah. And as he tries to sort of like, almost feels like he doesn't. He thinks you're beneath him. He tries to sidestep and leaves himself wide open. You yeah. just reach and just pluck out. <laughs> you you punch Cassius him in the daddy from issues. that. You punch him in the daddy issues. <laughs> Fuck yeah. And you concentrate hard on Cassius. You hear that lumble? Mm, thank you. Um, Surely thank you. Turns back and the platinum door disappears. The black disappears oh, as God. they melt into the floor, and you are left in a bare, empty chamber with the vault open in front of you. And that's where we're gonna take a break. We need ah. to- ah! WTF, man. WTF. The, yes, the WTF. best plan. Don't the go anywhere. Plan. We're just getting started. See you soon. Are we? Hello, it's us again, Sasha and David. Wrong way. <laughs> ah, hello. <laughs> You're here. <laughs> I was not expecting this, even though I was counted down. We're here. (laughs) And we're here to talk about Patreon. We have one. It's amazing. Yes. You know what we also have that's amazing? 
There's a Discord channel. There there's is a Discord, Discord channel. channel. Server. There's a whole Discord. That, that's One it. whole Discord. There's a ch I like how, you know, like when we play, I'm order and you're chaos. But whenever we do this, you're order and I'm chaos. It's lovely. Yeah, that's because I... I'm a businesswoman. Yes, David. and I'm insane. Yeah. There's also going to be bonus content. There's going to be content that you couldn't get access to at the same time before, but now you can. Ooh. That made sense. How many takes has it been? <laughs> and yeah, there's just going to be loads of extra bits and pieces, some behind the scenes stuff. Um, anything that we do will probably pop up on there first. So yeah, go check it out. Sash, what else do we have to see? Matt, stop laughing. <laughs> so if you're looking forward to just finding out a bit more about what we're doing behind the scenes, Helping us keep Matt stocked with hats, keep the padlocks on his cage. He needs so many hats. Oh, so many hats. But yeah, come check it out. We'll see you there. Oh, Bye. and thank you so much for all your love and support. <laughs> I'm saying it before Matt yells at me again. Really clenched it there, buddy. Really clenched it. Right. Bye, kids. <laughs>
I mean, we all, we have presentation, right? Like, you can yeah. make sound, smells, okay. tastes. Let's try and make it sound and smell like the catacombs, but not take the blindfold off. We'll just okay. take the ears out. I can make it smell like a wet, damp catacombs. Absolutely. I do that. I smell a wet, damp catacombs. Uh, roll a d20. <laughs> don't um, look, please. Don't look. Oh, it's bad again. It's a three. Hey! <laughs> For a ten. Smells like gold and metal. Ah, oh, shit. Great. Okay. Does someone else want to do something? Cause <laughs> I'm going to... I, I, I mean... What do you want to... Okay. What do you want to do, Tim? you need to let me in on the plan at this point, because clearly some <laughs> problem solving needs to happen. Well, our um, original plan... Oh, I'm still... Okay, just I'm, checking. Yeah, yeah. I'm cool. still, I Just guess. checking. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Our original plan was to make our way to the catacombs, but also to steal things from the vault, destroy the vault, and uh, then destroy make the it... Library and then make it look as though we were in the catacombs whilst we were in the vault, whilst it was very clear we were in the vault, Mm -hmm. and then we go to the catacombs very quickly. a double bluff. Using some sort of transportation. Yes. I love love the backdrop of just piles of golden items and you're just having this conversation right now. That's great. Great. Okay, in which case, um, (laughs) the arcane thing that's happening on this is that a is that a, an effect of the area, or is there a spell being cast? Uh, you you get the sense that the moment you begin to put any sort of arcane magic out, it immediately is suppressed. On the back of that, this is potentially quite a reasonable place to hold some sort of battle. Yeah. Yes, it is. Uh, hmm. Okay, so options I have. <laughs> I can do a suggestion. I can do a blindness deafness, I can do a dispel magic, and I can do a phantom steed. I think we I think we should we should just start looting and wait for them to turn up, and then probably this is a good place to have a final stand against Great. Galaxy. Uh if you want to get out, we're gonna have the same problem as we had before. Yeah, but What was the problem we had before? I can't cast a dimension door to get you out of here. Oh. Do you think one of these will help? And just gestures. <laughs> Great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, I need all of you to please make investigation checks, except mm-hmm. for you because you are blinded and deafened. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Which is a crying shame, having the best investigation. <laughs> what? Is it another three? It's three in a row. Yeah, and two Th- different dice. Three, three pops out. What? <laughs> <laughs> Fuck me. All right. Uh, for a total of. Oh fuck! Who cares? Um, let the others do theirs, and sure. then I'll tell you. Sure. Two. <laughs> Eleven. Jesus Christ. Well, I got a take seven. Blindfold off. Oh, it's tempting. <laughs> I mean, they know we're in the vault. Yeah, because you would have seen me go yeah. into it. And if we can't so, do yeah, the thing, well, so yeah. we'll take these off. Yeah, take, the take this off. Our plan has gone wrong. Right. We okay. You, you see them just sifting through gold coins, missing items and everything else that are falling like, there's through. There's a giant statue of a dimensional door. <laughs> we're just like, I wonder if this gold coin will help. <laughs> there's like no. a, thing, a thing which is like, solves all your problems and we're just there. So like, we're scrolls. <laughs> yeah. We're scrolls, MacGuffins. And I am going to very vividly play images of where I've been, just like traveling in my mind. Okay. Do it. Just, yeah, I want to try and throw them off as much as I can. Uh, wisdom rolls. 16. Eleven. Okay. He he's seen yeah, through it right away. I mean, he's here the explosion. He yeah. he knows what's going yeah, on. Yeah. 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 Would you like to also make an investigation? Check? I would like to go please. for it. Guidance. Thank you. <laughs> Why did you not do that when you were looking the first time? I forgot. Uh, I that is. Uh, do you get a thing with the book? Eight, Twelve. Uh, Eighteen. Yes, it would be advantage with the book as well. Eighteen. 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 All right. With an 18, you start to sift through, and the main things are you find what you're able to at least pick up, 12,000 gold to start with. Okay. All right. Let's see the sheet open. You find a collection of silver ingots, uh, a ivory figure of the Raven Queen, tossed to the sides. Um, you find a strange wand that sort of, sort of like vibrates a little bit with little electrical charges just popping off. A vibrating wand? <laughs> really? <laughs> oh, Una Hitachi, I see. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
Uh, you do see, you do find a fine (laughs) locked chest made of um, marble, which is shut. Like very, very heavy. You manage to sort of drag it out. Yeah. Um, Mm -hmm. There's, there's like one little keyhole in there, and no visible seam, but you manage to drag that out through. Um, even though with an 18, at this point, that's all you've really been able to find. Any Um, sort of discernible weapons or magical items? Uh, not with an 18. Oh, damn it. You, need to, you need to look a little bit harder for the good stuff. Uh, roll a d10. Me? Yes. I would consider... And a d100. Casting haste on a boy to improve the quickness of investigating searches. 39. Okay. Out of, out of one of the piles of gold, you do see a, a circular disc and an eye sort of like staring out. Looks like... A shield, potentially. Nice. Can I, like, using the tip of my rapier, just like shuffle some of the coins away? And, and, it, just, and it just sort of slides down and lands at your feet. So it's a shield. Yeah. Cool. Pick that bad boy up. Yeah, we'll grab, nice. grab the shield. Uh, Sentinel shield. Oh. Oh, hello. Um, can That's I um, hunt around for any healing potions? Uh, <laughs> yes, yes. If you're specifically looking for that. I specifically am looking for that. Can I roll? Should I roll first? Uh, roll investigation, Jane. Yeah. Oh, that that's much better. Eighteen. Oh, so Eighteen. Did you haste me, or you're thinking about it? I'm offering it as an oh, option. Oh, sorry, I didn't pick up on that at all. It's entirely up to you. Cool. I know. It might but, not well, work. Well, no, it probably won't work. Yeah. So just just so we're on the second round of investigation before I'm going to move the pot along, so we yeah. get another chance to have another go stuff. Cool. Oh. Uh, you managed to find. Uh, Are you all investigating again? Three <laughs> potions of greater healing. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm probably about to just down all of these, to be honest. So that's fine. Uh, you also do spot <laughs> atop the pile of, of silver coins. Not really worth your time, but you do see sort of precariously balanced a large vial, which looks like a better healing potion. If you would like to attempt to grab it, obviously yes. Of course. <laughs> cool. Uh, how do you go about this? So it's perched atop. A it's, it's like there's a pile of coins, and it's just sort of sitting, and it looks like the slightest move could knock it one way or another to the floor. Okay. Um, mage, mage hand? I don't have mage hand. Would you like me to get that for you? Ooh. It looks like you're trying to collect that large vial. How, you like how high up that? is it? 70 feet. 70 feet? Yeah. <laughs> you're going fine with it? Look at that face. Look at that face. I'm going to turn into a bird and go get it. Okay. <laughs> But a big enough bird, <laughs> so that it's just fine. Like, I'm going to drop it. Like, I don't know how, how big is it. Do I need to be a pigeon? Do oh, it's, it's about it's about it's about the size of Liza. Okay, yeah. an eagle then. Like cool. An, 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 we'll go be a, like a golden right. I mean, I, I have an owl in my pocket if you want. The owl's probably too small though, right? I thought you were just hooty to see me. Oh, babe. If you, think, <laughs> if you think Hootie can carry it, we can send oh, Hootie. Oh, no, out. Hootie's long dead. This is Nyx. Oh, so I mean, I mean Nyx. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's fine. If you think Nyx would can Nyx it? be able to carry it? Uh, there would be a role involved, but yes. You do you think? Eagle's probably going to be strong. I don't want to rob you of a healing potion. So, cool, you'd like to. Yeah, yeah, cool, yeah, yeah. wild check. You And what, what, does, what does this look like? Um, is it is it Zach Braff? Yeah, it's very, it's very similar. Um, <laughs> I just got that. That's why I went. Yeah. yeah. Um, so my, um, Myla is going to turn to Alexi and go, "Do you remember how ages ago I said that it would be completely ridiculous if I turned into anything that bamf into an eagle?" <laughs> <laughs> There's a little puff of feathers. Your skills are expanding, dear. It's lovely to see. <laughs> cool, you take off uh, and you manage to go up. I am going to make you roll just just a dexterity check, just in case you fail spectacularly. Should I check what an eagle um, is? I got it, I got it. Okay, yeah, what's sorry. my eagle dex? Uh, well, just roll a d20, I'll tell you what to add. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Uh, giant eagle, let's say dex, you got a plus three. That's, that's pretty good, that's yeah. pretty good, that's pretty good. It's a 15. Plus 15. Three. You clamp it into claws, you bring it down, you drop it in front gently. Uh, it is a potion of supreme healing. Oh, nice. Supreme! Supreme. So that is um, 10 d4. It's 10 d4 plus, plus 10. Do you Ooh. want some d4s? So, yeah, 20, um, well, hang on. So first of all, I'm going to chug these. <laughs> yeah, right. If you want some d4s, I've got a bunch will, of them. Uh, Supreme I'll, healing, I'll give you 30. Supreme healing, I'll give you 30. Okay. So Good yeah, take. if I chug, I'll chug yeah. these. Cool. So we got, uh, oh, that's, that's, um, <laughs> and then I plus add four to this, right? Yep, yep. So that's. I'll let you do that in the corner. I trust yeah. you to do your math. Cool. Five, Two. 
Cool, we're on the next round yeah, of investigating. Round what, of what, investigation. Are you looking for something in particular or are you just doing a general sweep? I, oh. Two has been arranging piles of coins into traps. Okay. Because this is the perfect place to, to teach people, okay. to let them learn. And so we'll see what crops up when he's trying Great. to make things. No, I'm, I'm here things. for it. Uh, and, you, uh, yeah. All right, let's do this. Oh, good, good. That's a five. <laughs> okay. Uh, was that a straight roll? Yeah. Can I have Nyx help him? Sure. With his eyes of thingy and... With his is that, is that advantage? Uh, yeah, it'd be the help action. Cool. So you just get advantage. Okay. I'm not looking at it. Because that's a nine. <laughs> Nine total. Oh no, sorry, eight total. Eight. <laughs> he's not good in it. He's a little wooden boy who's designed to smashy smashy. He doesn't like rifling through things. Okay. What I will say, even with a <laughs> nine, <laughs> you're throwing throwing gems and everything over the shoulder. You're sort of digging out of one pile as you make these. You do notice this sort of like long pole sticking out of one of the piles that is sort of being loosened away as you go. That will provide a learning experience. Make a strength check, please, to try and pull it out. Because I've been rolling so well so far. Natural fucking 20. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Can't find anything, but when I find it, cool. it's mine. There we go. I love so... this the angriest anyone's ever said natural 20. <laughs> <laughs> cool. Mila's just been sitting there downing these things, and she's back up to almost full hit points. Glug, glug, glug. But I've still got the supreme. Well, I haven't used the supreme. Yet. Understood, yeah. understood. Like a big dribble. Cool. Mark. You, yeah. you grab it, and you, you, you think it's going to be more resistant. You don't. It just sort of cleanly comes out. There's a smatter of a coin that comes out with it, uh, and you hold this long, lovely, sort of like silver pommel with a nice sapphire grip uh, warhammer in your hand. Um, big hammer. Big, big hammer. Are I'll send you the stats for that shortly. Traps? Thank you. Is that what you're doing? No, he's stealing a warhammer. Oh, stealing a warhammer. Four. Failing mostly. What are you doing? Um, I am doing. Big hammer. You happy? Oh, uh, yeah. Okay. I've already really had my Mila. magic item for this game. It's getting hotter. So Carry on. It's getting hotter? Yep. Milo's noticed it's getting warmer. Carry on. Okay, cool. Um, I am... Basically, I've opened the bag of holding. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> While I'm doing this, I'm looking for the, for the most goth, blood, edgy shit I can find. <laughs> just because, like... <laughs> I think that they'll miss it the most. <laughs> sure, sure, go for it, go for it. Uh, roll, roll the, roll the d twenty for me. I'm going to use your rolling. Thank you for your. Uh, <laughs> um, Is that cool. three? No, no, it's it's uh, it's only a, it's a five, so that makes it a nine. Okay. I just can't roll for shit. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just picking up black coins. <laughs> I would like to find. Hundreds of vials of blood, please. <laughs> no, I don't think you'll find <laughs> that in there. Um, while that's happening, can I uh, get Nata's crystal out of the pack? Whoop. Okay. Oh, yes, Matthew. <laughs> oh, yes. I've remembered that it exists and it's going to be used. Cool. Oh, um, you managed to pick up another 5,000 or so gold pieces uh, mm. and you also find uh, the edgiest thing I could find on a quick Google. Uh, which I'm sending to you now. Um, but you, you pull out what looks like a large skull about the size of a hill giant uh, with a stake through, and there are little like green lights in oh, the front there. Yeah. Yeah. I haven't even looked at the description on that. Uh, we'll look at that later. Cool. All right. We're on the last roll before we're going to advance the plot along. Okay. Alexi, uh, you're up. Cool. Ideally, <laughs> some sort of bitch in magic item. I know exactly. David knows exactly what he wants, but... Oh, I, I never want anything fancy. I just want like boots. Weird effects. Oh, here. that's gonna be good. That's a twenty-five. <laughs> Is that a natural twenty? No. <laughs> Dirty twenty-five. Okay. Sorry, Jeff. It's not gonna happen. Uh, cool. Couple of things. Is Jeff in this fall? No, no, it's not. We had a, <laughs> we had a, we had a, we had a thing going. A little bit. Cool. Uh, amongst the gold and the items that you're pulling out, you also find as. Tude is pulling away coins and making traps. As your hand finally starts to hit the floor, you do feel wood. And you sort of feel around a little bit with the 25 and you feel a wooden hatch. Trap door! Oh. Underneath. Secret the door. Of Secret door. Secret tunnel. Cool, can I? Secret tunnel. Secret. Secret tunnel. Shift some of the stuff and open the hatch. Uh, two more things. Uh, oh, sorry. No, no, it's all right. 
Uh, <laughs> you find a very fine suit of plate armor with magical encrusted emeralds across the front of it. Uh, clang, 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 uh, clang. Which is a suit of plus two plate armor with your 25. Well done. Uh, you find a life-size marble statue of your father uh, thrown to the side. Oh. Nude. Uh, you find a thousand platinum in a little chest. <laughs> Excuse me, we said nude? <laughs> oh, nude, nude yes. Yeah. Oh, and cool. actu- actual size. Actual size as well. Uh, kind of Burt Reynolds. Is he, is he a man housing. in proportion? It's, 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 a little, it's a little misshapen. Okay. Kind of looks like one of those tomatoes. <laughs> Putting aside my dad's penis for a minute, how many platinum? You're gonna a thousand need a strength platinum. Check for that. <laughs> hmm? You're gonna need a strength check for that. Uh, <laughs> or at least a constitution. Too many naked cards on the mention today. <laughs> yeah, it's constitution, Jesus. Right. And uh, just so it's more Charisma fun. Charisma save. Uh, to roll a d100 for me, please. Okay. Or oh, d10 for me first, please. D10. Sorry. How many platinum was it? Sorry, we. One thousand. One thousand. Uh, two. A two. Okay. Yeah. And now a D100, thank D100. you. D100. That's so secret. Where did all of my things? D100. 23. 23. Uh, do, 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 do. Oh, cool. Man. This is the rare variety, Alexi, that you managed to pull out this large potion, um, sort of like starts quite high and it's got a big fat bottom on it basically with a little fat red potion, co- fat bottom potions cool Sorry. get on your bike uh, but it is a cool. potion of dragon's breath oh, cool. you're able to like it's labeled you're able That's to instantly recognize <laughs> um, that and it is the rare variety cool uh, right we've gone around the room a couple of times Miley, you notice the temperature is starting to rise just just a little bit not uncomfortable you do notice that the, the, the floor is starting to feel a little bit warm Ooh, this castle's, castle's got heated floors. What happens next? There's a trap door. I trap door! Say. Okay. Uh, what would you like to do with it? Fucking uh, open first it. First of all, I want to check it for any sort of obvious trap. Go for it. Milo is just going to let everyone know that it's getting warm. Thank cool. you very much. Investigation? Investigation. Um, that is another 25. 25? 25? Uh, it is not trapped, but it is it is securely locked. There is a triple bolt going through on each side that would take some work to unlock or undo at this point. Or a very special key. If there is consent to being used. I'm so, I'm so down with that key being used. I'm fine with the explosive key being used. Is this the disintegration key? Yeah. Cool, just get it up. Put the key in. Okay. The key goes in and immediately you have to let go as your hands, it's like burns a little bit and it just, and then the door sits around evaporates away and there is a sudden release of heat and this wave comes up over you all of your hair is blown back or lack of hair in all of our cases uh, I can't take mine off now the bulk cap's gone <laughs> you, you look down you see soft red glows at the bottom and just this almost bellowing of hot air coming out every now and then is there, there a dragon in there? I'm going to smash that marble chest while we're here <laughs> I want to go through the maybe, hole. Maybe smash the lock, not the chest itself. Ah, that would be more reasonable. Yes. I don't think it's got a lock. It's got hasn't got a seam. Um, I want to go in the hole. Okay. What's in there? You just jump down into the hole. Fuck yeah, Dragon. let's go. All right, four. Jump straight down into the hole. Oh dear. <laughs> Fall, 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 Full, yeah, that's enough dice. Um, when can I see the floor? Uh, you see the floor when it hits you in the face after you've dropped uh, that many feet. So you take 8, 11, 16, 20, 22. This is a terrible roll. 23, 26, 32, 33, 34 points of bludgeoning damage as you land on the floor. You're full broken by more and more piles of gold. Little pockets of lava do... Baby girl, I'm not experiencing any of that. I had 19 hit points. Oh, then you're knocked out. <laughs> you see four drop? I'm jam, baby Gone. cakes. I think we should probably go down there. It's what four would have wanted, but also, yes, we should go. <laughs> <laughs> uh, both of you two start to hear movement out beyond as well as it appears the door starts to make oh, movement outside. Oh, question, actually. Yes. Um, I 
The only thing I did was 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 necking potions. Yes. If I'd have done that as an eagle, would that have restored my Myla hit? Points? No. No. Okay, so I'd have to drop it. Okay, yeah. Fair enough. Um, yeah. Uh, how do we get down the very deep hole? Uh, jump you and have I will rope. cast Featherfall. Oh, what's that? Uh, it slows our descent. Oh, cool. Oh. I would be most grateful. I would, Thank you. I would also be very grateful for that. It might not work. Oh. Featherfall is a reaction, so it can only be done after the fact. Yeah. It might. Uh, hang on, because I, I need to rope. remember the detail. You of You're unconscious. Rope. <laughs> rope. Uh, oh yeah, it's two's up to five, so I'm I'm good. Okay. Yeah. So you jump down the hole. So we have to just jump and. Hope. I I can only do it after when we're falling. Oh. Yes. I am tentative about falling. I am also concerned about the falling. I'm very concerned. The door starts to open. Let's oh dear. Let's go. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I'm gonna, yeah. I was like, you need because I'm still holding the rapier. I'm like, you need to grab my arm. Oh. I grab your hand. <laughs> like, two, one, oh dear. two, three. <laughs> okay. Uh, you cast Feather Fall? Yes, but I want to wait a bit. Like, you know. So you're hopefully out of the area of that. effect. Yeah. We saw four fall. Did I see? Because I was obviously looking how long the fall it, was. She for. fell. They fell into darkness. You don't see. You don't see how long it took. Did, Did I hear any? You heard a bum run. It was a significant amount of time. Uh, Define significant. Uh, it was about. The fall was probably about 120 feet. Like, okay. It's it's a big drop. All right. But how so long was that in seconds? Probably that? about 12 seconds. It was six. Oh, I don't know what the falling thing is. 9.8. About around round, round and a half. Okay. Yeah. Cool. Under 10. We're talking like one, two, three. <laughs> Cool. Uh, you wait just long enough to see Evil Lexi walking through and lock eyes with you before you drop. Yep. Cool. Toodles. Roll a d20 and add your spellcasting modifier, please. Oh, I'm bad at that. It's a lower DC Guidance. because you've waited. No, I, no. I'm falling in a hole. Guidance is a tut. Did you all go at the same time? Yeah, all right, I'll yeah. allow I'll allow That's it. That's why I was like... Roll a d20 and add your spellcasting modifier. Fuck. <laughs> you first. <laughs> Okay, it's gonna be it's gonna be good. Um, that's a twenty. Twenty. Okay, yeah, you are guided. Natural one. You feel Fucking empowered. You feel stunning. the touch of Myla on your arm, and feeling all the confidence of a straight white man <laughs> immediately. How do you know he's straight? All the this confidence man is a of a middle class white man. Anyway, <laughs> the spell fails, no, and you begin. <laughs> Okay, do you communicate that this hasn't worked? Yes. Giant Eagle. Okay. Good. Giant Eagle. Giant yeah. Eagle works because... <laughs> you threw me off, man. <laughs> the worst. Cool. Giant Eagle. Giant Eagle. Great. You've got time to catch one. Or is it I both mean, of them? I'm holding on to both of them. Oh, it's Giant Eagle. Giant Eagle is fucking... It's huge, my boy. Make an athletic check. Fine, 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 fine. As Myla or as the oh, eagle? Oh, as the eagle. Absolutely. Fuck as me, the what's eagle. that? Oh, that's Dex, isn't it? So. Uh, athletics, strength, plus three. It's the same. Plus three. Same fine, role. fine, fine, fine. Oh, it? oh it, it's. Yeah. yeah no, uh, dirty 20. Dirty 20. All right. You managed to catch both at the same time. Alexis, you realize what's gone wrong. Yeah. Just as quick, claws <laughs> dug into you, and you are good to go. Yeah. And you I did not realize Featherfall turned Myla into an eagle. Uh, it, it, Where do you think the fucking out feathers out of came from, idiot? <laughs> <laughs> uh. <laughs> Cool. We fly down to an unconscious fall. So hang on. I want just I want it to be known that as Myla catches both of them, this eagle is like looking at Alexi and basically being like, <laughs> and just making these like really irritated chicken noises. Cyril Cyril pops out on top and also starts having a go at you. <laughs> right. Okay. Very powerful magic in that vault, if you don't mind. Don't. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. Yeah, you've come back by this point. Uh, roll all your hit dice just to see how much health you have. Fuck me. Do you want some... D6, please. Or I can just do it now for you if you want. No! Okay. You're going to roll better, and it's more funny if I don't roll badly. Watch it roll all sixes. Nope. Ten. <laughs> Four. Is your Fourteen. Seventeen. And a five. Twenty-two. Twenty-two and... 28. Cool. You come to stand up. <laughs> slowly right. You're about knee deep in gold coins. Thank you. And you, you, you sort of watch and see the failing feather fall and then them turn into an eagle as they float down. And you look across and you hear this deep. Mm. 
He's asleep. Is he a dragon? Your eyes adjust as you see the body of a quite large but still young red dragon asleep, slumbering amongst the coins. I love him. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, can we cuddle them? No. <laughs> Why not? What I look next? around for a way out. Sure. Uh, you, your, your eyes adjust, but it's still quite... You don't have dark... Do you have dark vision? I don't think changelings do. I don't believe they do. Uh, you can make a perception check with a disadvantage then, please. Can we see... Or can particularly me see the... As, as you come down, you with your eagles, eagles of vision, you, you do notice a sleeping red dragon amongst amongst the coins. Yeah, you don't see. Yeah, you, you, you think you can see some light in a distance, but that's about it. Um, but at this point, you come, you land, you drop the other two off. Okay. And all of you hear the deep, rhythmic breathing, and you realize where the hot air was coming from was, yeah. was the breath. Yeah. Media's like... That was find a way out. Do you want to cast Pass Without a Trace? I'm an eagle. Ah. But you should probably... The, the eagle is going to be like... Okay, we follow the eagle. Oh. We get on the eagle's back. I reckon I can like try yeah. and carry all the While way. I'm here, I'm going to cast Prayer of Healing. I think that's wise. Okay, yeah. without without issue. Cool. Ooh. Yeah. And so that will be 2d8 plus that. So. Oh, so that is everybody gets 15 points of... Thank you very much, sir. 15 points back. Despite the fall and the noise, the dragon doesn't seem to have stirred at this point. However, you're acutely aware that you were just seen dropping down into yeah. the hole. Great. Yeah. Um, so we can fly away, and I'm going to try and look for an... I'm going to start like sure. circling the big camp, make, basically like, looking for a way out. Make an investigation check. Uh, perception check. Perception check. Yes. And I have advantage on perception checks that rely on sight. Eagle eyes. Eagles. eagles. E- do eagles have dark vision? Uh, I don't think they do. It says rely on vision. I don't think it matters. Uh, I'm going to say it's a straight roll cool. rather than disadvantage. Nice. 14 plus uh, 18. 18. Cool. Beyond the dragon, you do see the cave start to carve off in a particular direction. Uh, Four, you're about to say something. Sorry. No, I was just trying to figure out with the group whether you wanted to sneak out of here or if you wanted us to be somewhere else now. Because I can now cast Dimension Door if we would like. Oh, I mean, feel free to tell that, what, say that as yes. the eagle is just sort of... I'm whispering it. Very, yes. Very yes. S- I, I whisper it once we exit this chamber. Okay. You um, start to... F- so you're flying up or you're flying down, down that, the tower? Whatever that thing Doing was, that, so that, like, that passage. Oh. Yeah. Or yep. hut start heading down that passage. Okay. Do I need to... I think that would be best. <laughs> I need... I'm still holding the ray through. It's still ignited. Oh. I need you to get my other ear. Oh. Mm. Oh, that's... Yeah, I'm going to sort of block my... Weirdly sticky. Because <laughs> he's wooden. Uh, you now have uninspiration. <laughs> <laughs> I know you already used it. I'm going to force a negative roll on you. Yeah, no, never again. Yeah, I'm I'm blinding and deafening myself. Cool. You fly away without an issue. The floor drops away and you keep flying five minutes, ten, deeper, but you feel like you're going down. Um, Up, oh. Can I... Uh, as we go, I would like to collapse part of the tunnel behind us. Okay. How would you like to go about that? I would like to use my sick brain um, to find something to spot like a structurally supportive pillar or bit where I think there might be a weakness and then I'm going to make him do it. <laughs> <laughs> With a big hammer. <laughs> yeah. With a big hammer. Mm-hmm. Uh, which have I sent you the... Um, fun no. fact. I, I will do Eagles that. understand common so you can just tell me shit. Love that. I mean, I think I understand common either way because I'm. It's still Myla, but like, yeah. but it's still cool. Yeah. It also means if I polymorph any of you into a giant eagle, you can actually understand what's going on. Oh well, wow. that's which good. Is pretty handy. And then we can bring our wings around and just be like, dish. Cool. We'll iron out the details uh, shortly, but cool, I'll send cool, that cool. to you. Cool. Uh, make and actually no, no, I like that. That's that's very cool. You 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 flying through. You do notice 
the cave's very uneven and seems like it's been bearing the weight of some shitty dynasty for a long time. Yeah, true. And there are a couple of points you could probably knock it out and and cause some structural damage at this point. How long are you waiting for before you do this? Are you doing this straight away or are you waiting? No, I want to give it like a minute and a half. Okay. So that we've so, like headed down a Sure, sure. Way. Understood. Yeah, yeah. Understood. I want to make it make it so that the, it's not going to immediately wake the dragon, but also people won't get very far before there's quite a big Understood. gap Understood. between us and the rockfall. Cool. All right. You aren't flying very quickly. You are carrying three people. Yeah, so yeah, you're, yeah. You're, 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 you're moving at a pretty slow pace. Uh, cool. Make an attack roll for me then, please, uh, Toot, to okay. knock some of these pillars down as you fly. Uh, so first one is 18. Okay. Good hit. Uh, Don't worry about damage yet. Yeah, no. Second one, 12. Okay, one more. Sorry, I looked. That's okay. Last one is 23. 23. Yeah, this is why it didn't look. <laughs> with, with the guidance of four, you sort of fly through and, like, like batter, batter up, you swing straight through. And after the third hit, you definitely start to feel some rumbles here, some splashes, and. <laughs> However, that does seem the breathing even at this distance with the splashes and noise seems to stop and there seems to be a deeper growl starts to echo and catch up with you through Good the shit. chamber oh dear love that for us what happens okay. next i'm just gonna keep flying on do down. you want to go quicker if you're gonna do a thing do the thing yeah i cast haste on the eagle and we hold the fuck on <laughs> 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 okay with the beard that's superb so <laughs> You take off, all of you hang on, now going at full speed compared to what you were in. For the next minute, flying, hurtling, not a problem. After a minute, your joints lock yeah. up and you start to fall and tumble. <laughs> Splash as you land in this gross, swampish, murky water. Great. Hey guys. So what's the next step of your plan, just so that we're clear? Oh, this is well beyond our plan. Great, that's what I thought. Cool. Um, where's your... <laughs> I know where the... Um, wait. Wait. <laughs> wait! Let me get my fucking words out. I know where the vault is, the um, place that you wanted us to go, because uh, we the discussed archives. the yeah. archives previously, because we've sure. discussed it. In which case, now is a great time to believe that we're in the catacombs and blip us to the archives using a twinned <sighs> dimension door. The archives is leading to, to the, the catacombs. catacombs. Okay. Yeah, the archives is the entrance to the catacombs. They still think we're in the treasury, mm -hmm. which okay. is fine. That's great. Where are we fucking going, team? Catacombs. Archives. We're in the fucking catacombs. We're not. You are at this point. So the the archive was on the floor, basically where the vaults were, where you're some sort of. Oh, so we've it. gone through a different way. You've essentially found there. a different way to somewhere. You don't know if you're yeah, going towards yeah. the yeah. catacombs, but you are going deep under the castle. Logically, it makes sense. You're heading in the right direction. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Going to the archives would essentially be going back. Oh, yeah, may as well just yeah. carry on with the course. Hmm. Okay. Uh, where in the catacombs are we heading, team? <laughs> Catacombs, Alexei knowing that there is an entrance to the catacombs in the archives and that there's shit down there is as far as he ever got. Cool beans. Great, we're lost, no problems. Um, great. As in he was conveniently thrown out before getting to that point, almost like they were trying to hide something. Okay, team, like we've dragon. got two mm, options. No, dragon's mm. protecting it. Hide this? and let the thing go past us or go fucking somewhere else. What do you want to do? Speak now for ho forever hold thy peace. Can't hear a thing. <laughs> the, the, the eagle will hold up a single large feather. Yes, which option is... Option one. Option one. Hide. I would like to hide. Great. I cast hallucinatory terrain and I make there appear to be a wall where there isn't one and a, uh, like, so that we're, instead of being in a side, like, turn off, it looks like there's straight a wall that, so that we can go past, it can go past us. Okay. And are you doing it so it's on the other side? So you're we're here, the wall's it. here, or you're, yeah. be you're behind the wall? Okay, great. Uh, what is your spell save DC to do that? My spell save DC is 15. Okay. So it's probably got true sight. It's probably going to fuck her. Uh, up, what is the... What is your spell save? 15. 15. 15. Uh, sorry, is it an intelligence save? I could yes. come out of wild shape and 
pass without a trace us. That's but, probably. But a then good that's idea. it. There's that's no your more, wild shapes. No more wild yeah. shapes, and any future flying is gone. Yeah. Which Leave it as that? is. We'll fucking see what we do. It, we're probably going to end up fighting a dragon. So steam. Try In that my case, best. Let's let's. I'll I'll pass without a trace. Cool. Well, we're going to roll. Oh, sorry. Are we doing? Are we doing closer? Yes, yeah, so we're going to do both. Okay. Are you we'll dropping? Do, I'll drop and pass without sure? trace. I think it makes more sense. Okay. Okay. Yeah. You've dropped. 12. 12. So 15. Plus 2. 14. It's 14. You hear the beat of rush, the beat and rushing wings as. <laughs> and so. <laughs> stops in just the soft flap. It sort of lands. <laughs> We've all got a path of that, Trace. Cool. Stealth checks, everyone. <coughs> to try and hide your scent. Well, I have plus pressed the digitation. Plus ten. And okay. Already once today, I've made the smell of catacombs. Okay. Twenty-five. Twenty-nine. Sorry. Twenty-five. Twenty-nine. Uh, bearing in mind that I roll disadvantage on all stealth, that was a natural twenty and a seven. So. But plus ten. Oh yeah, plus ten. Half so, trace. So, so nineteen in total. Nineteen also. <laughs> you wait, and you hear the scratching of rocks. You hear the collapsing of more cave falling in behind you, and the dragon. This low growl sort of sits, <sighs> and you suddenly feel this heat start to rise, and the water around you begins to bubble as, <laughs> with a roar of frustration, the dragon takes off and flies back the other way. With an 18 perception check just <gasps> falling under me. Oh, I have been rolling like dog shit. <laughs> 18 is not got... dog shit. I've rolled three yeah. threes in a row. <laughs> <laughs> if I get an 18, I feel good about my yeah, life. Yeah, exactly. Sorry, Mr. Seven Natural 20. <laughs> <laughs> you, you get the sense, despite the rage, a little bit great here. Thank you. You get, you get the sense. There's almost a... <laughs> A sense of relief Sorry. almost <laughs> comes through and what feels like a very sarcastic sigh like a resignation as the dragon uh. flies off. It's quiet. You are all wet in the water. What happens next? Um, Myla's going to say, Well, I'm glad I didn't have to use my draconic on that because I'm a little rusty. Yeah, me too. Uh, I'm not worried about your draconic, but you know. Do we believe that Alexi would be familiar with this area? No. God, no. No. Okay, free him. Oh, that feels horrible. Wisdom well, save. No one is no, no one is keeping yours on there. No. Eight. Seven. It's okay. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh, oh. <laughs> the chess game continues. It continues. <laughs> mm. Sorry, he's still there. We're in the catacombs. Surprise! I Okay. Uh, do I recognize any of this? You're not quite in the catacombs yet, but no, you don't recognize this. You don't recognize the smells, the sounds. You know you are deep under the castle. Some nerd part of your brain recognizes maybe some of the, the rock and the, the limestone. Yeah. But you know the tunnel keeps on going. And we you, can, you can gather roughly where you are under the castle. We're not, but we need to keep going that way. Did you know you have a dragon? No. But that makes a lot of sense, actually. You recall... Eating floors. Mm. <laughs> yeah. I remember when those were installed. <laughs> you recall Derek teasing, pretending they were going to feed you to the dragon when you, were, when you were younger. Oh. You know what? So much of the bullying makes sense now. Oh. The dragon is the thing that made the bullying oh, make no, sense? Oh, no. They kept... Um, Derek <laughs> kept saying that he was going to uh, uh, slip me a, a potion of sleep and then throw me into a dragon pit. David. So, uh, stop sending him sweet nothings and flirting during the game. It's very unprofessional. It's very distracting. Do I? It's just it's 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 the name you were told. Oh, so Paraxius is real. Oh well, that's fun. Sure. Anyway, I'm ashamed of you, and I hope that you die in a fire. Let's go. <laughs> Uh, uh, we need to keep going, and with that, he's just gonna. Yeah. yeah are you go. aware of where we are? No, but I can piece it together, which means I can as well. Yeah. I apologize. Slap. Blindfold. <laughs> Blindfold. Right. 
I am sorry. <laughs> we do the shake. Right. <laughs> it's like, uh, spin around. You do the hokey pokey, ratchet. you turn them all around, and that's yeah. what it's all about. Where are we going? That's continuing down all the All right. Tunnel. Make a survival check then, please, as you head deeper into the cave systems. An owl's going to help you. Uh, I mean, it's a it's a 23. <laughs> You're <laughs> out. But, but thank you. Do you know what advantage? Yeah, yeah. Oh, I mean, sure. <laughs> so it's a twenty-seven. <laughs> <laughs> you just think you just teleport to the to the catacombs and it's fine. Yeah. With, without it's issue, <laughs> you you make you make your way through. No, oh, sorry. Are you through. are you are you flying or are you? I no. can't fly. You can't oh, fly. Okay. All right. It is slow going, and it takes you the better part of, I'd probably say three hours to walk through what would have otherwise been quite a nice flight. Uh, constitution saving throws for the three of you as you begin to come and arrive. Three of us? Which three? Three. Uh, this is for um, exhaustion checks. Natural 20. Fine. It's a 15. That's fine. Pass. Oh, I see. Yeah. Well, yeah. Con save. 11. So the day has taken its toll on you and you are, you're feeling pretty that exhausted sense. when you arrive. Eventually the water gives way to, to slippery rock and moss and the smell of brimstone and dragon and flame gives way to petrichor and moss, yes. Is this difficult terrain? Yeah. yeah it's it not is. for me, it isn't. Roll with advantage. Thank you. Also, <laughs> technically, I'm being carried, so I wouldn't need to roll. It's advantage. still a lot for you. <laughs> it's, it's, been a day. Difficult. it's emotionally it's difficult. It's been a day. Let's go with But yes, I, it isn't difficult terrain. Water gives way to rock, gives way to mud, gives way to dirt, and you find yourselves going deeper and deeper where no natural light pierces through, save for the odd glow worm or little creature sort of like ducking away some bioluminescent. Uh, yes? White Tomo. I was going to say. It's uh, exactly White Tomo, yeah. A wetter crawls across his I, face. I will pat Alexi and will cast light on his coat. <laughs> Using oh no, the rapier um, is like a torch. When it's oh. so no, I like the coat thing better. Nice. I think. Uh, so idea, the idea of you being carried, being turning from black to white as you're led deep yeah, into sure. catacombs. My coat's now white. Yeah. There, there. And eventually, Ooh. a different breeze starts to pick up, and a room opens out with just the odd little beams of light cutting through the darkness, like little spotlights. As the first thing to greet you is a massive face of the Raven Queen. Oh. You look down and a large temple sits at the bottom, carved into the bottom of I'm the sure cavern, which you don't you that. don't see. <laughs> sets of stairs, very fine, not touched for a very long time, clearly. Oh. And you look down, it's probably about a 250 foot drop from where, from where you are. But you believe, at least at this point, you've arrived. I feel it would be best if we... I think so. Very good. We'll take off the blindfold, take out the ears things. You have a right wisdom saving throw. <laughs> Would you like to look at five? <laughs> oh, God damn it, David! I was. I didn't see that one. Thirteen. You feel ah. he makes a good move. Mm. Right. Well, the upside is he's got a long way to go before he finds us. Well, it it, it has at least bought us some time. Okay, I have no idea what any of this is. Wonderful. Then we Glad have we succeeded. <laughs> Should we set it on fire or steal? Mm. Just because I don't know doesn't mean he doesn't. Oh. But why would he need me if he really knows about this place? I believe you're a sacrifice, aren't you? You're a sacrifice for Torob, not for... Oh, I feel like this is maybe a chance to have a talk to Mother. I think... Yes. Renew one's vows, as it were. I look up at the giant face. It the Raven Queen. stares into the distance. Is it, how like how close is it? Um, probably about sixty feet away, but it is massive. It's it's it's, like it's a similar down. size. Yeah, yeah. Need to go down into it's a similar thing. size to the um Titan that you found on top of the mountain. Right. Yeah, but it's it is truly it's bigger than the dragon. Looking at the statue, do oh, I babe, get so any? Oh, do don't, I don't. feel anything? Okay, you don't worry. <laughs> you you. 
feel a wriggling in your heart. Oh. Like someone's tickling it from the inside. Oh. It's very unpleasant. Can I, like, Gross. focus on that? Like, trying to extrapolate that feeling? You figure can, out you can engage with it if you like. Yeah. Okay. Torog. You focus for a moment as the sound of your friends falls away and you start to feel something like literally tugging at your heartstrings. Do you try and engage with it? Yeah, boy. Does it, when you say it, tugging, is it like... You feel like it, a physical sensation on your chest all of a sudden. All right. In, I'm assuming it's the negative tugging on heartstrings as opposed to the positive kind. It's it's a very uncomfortable feeling, as if something is having a an allergic reaction within you looking at that right oh, now. Oh, God, that I want to fight that. Okay. Yeah. Make a... I'm deadly serious when I say this. Are you sure? That I want to fight. Are you sure you want to do this? Yes. Okay. You focus for a moment and you channel your blood into the center, willing it back into your heart. Gross. You drop to your knees and you grip the stone as you force every fiber of your being to push back whatever the sensation is on your chest. We'll pat All of us and are going to put a hand like on... You can give them a guidance if you would like. Yep. 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 You and need I to make a constitution saving throw. Good luck, my guy. <laughs> the DC is 21. Kids, it's been fun. Hooray! Uh, uh, oh, wait. Uh, uh, if there's uh, anything else you want to give to help, now's the time. As uh, you visibly see this take place. I'd like to be helpful. Um... I can, yeah, I can probably help somehow. Not sure how. Okay. I'm going to do some uh, sorcerer accounting. Great. So I am going to exchange a first level spell slot for two sorcery points, which then brings me up to seven sorcery points. Sorry. Um, And then I'm going to use six of those to convert to one fourth level spell slot. Okay. Leaving me with one. And then I'm going to cast Death Ward. Thank you. <laughs> okay. So, um, instead um. of dropping to zero, you drop to one. If the target is subject to an effect that would kill it instantaneously, that effect is instead negated and the spell ends. Thank you very much. And I'm going to cast Beacon of Hope. What does that do? You pull out a thing. Uh, advantage on wisdom saving throws and death saving throws and regains maximum number of hit points. I will say thematically for this, you roll with advantage. Thank you very much, everyone. Myla, is there anything else? Myla's just there like, kiss him. <laughs> <laughs> that kiss. would probably do the opposite of what we want here. <laughs> Inspiration. That, that would make the blood pump a lot quicker. <laughs> Not an erection joke, get your mind out of the gutter. I meant more, I'd explode and probably kill him. Yeah, That was my main concern. Alexi, you focus and this thing inside you knows it's time to fight. Roll. (sighs) 24. Yeah! (laughs) Okay. Woo. Good work, Matt. <laughs> Good job, Matt. Fucking Good love job, you, love. <laughs> <laughs> you watch as Alexi begins to retch and cough and fight, and you crawl to the edge, the lip of this cliff, and <laughs> and suddenly you start to feel this thing that was on your heart start to move inside you and start to crawl up through your neck. And anyone that was to look in your mouth would start to see gross fingers start to spill out of your mouth and attempt to crawl out and grab your face however the sheer force of your will of your blood of your body pushes this hand out and suddenly with one final heaving wretch you manage to cough and grab and wrestle and yank this entire thing out as this limp hand lands on the ground and starts sort of like wriggling and fighting stab down with the right yeah. <laughs> See you next week. Ah! Son of a bitch!
We've been Matt Bateman. We've all been We've Matt, all Bateman. Been Matt, Bateman. Matt Bateman. Bateman. Thank Happy you so Halloween. much for watching. It's been Matt Bateman. Matt Bateman. Matt Bateman. Matt Bateman. Matt Bateman. Matt Bateman also on lights, camera, and sound. Thank you so much. Thank you for watching. Amazing musicians, creators, artists. Matt Bateman, Matt Bateman, Matt Bateman's, Matt Bateman, Matt Bateman. all Matt Bateman's all the way down. Music by Matt Bateman, Matt Bateman on the socials. And thank you so much to all of the Matt Batemans who support us on On Matt Matreon. Matreon. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a piece of shit. Uh, right, <laughs> with that being said, we'll be back in a couple of weeks and we'll pick up where we left off on that. Jesus Christ. That was some beautiful stuff. Thanks so much for watching. See you soon. Bye. Bye, 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 bye. bye. Batrium. It was right there. Batrium. Oh. <laughs>